four. Thank you all for joining us today. I'm Shelley Kirk. As the Evansville Purple Aces prepare to take to the court tonight, the lawyer for their former coach, Walter McCarty, reacts to yesterday's firing, saying McCarty was shocked by the university's decision and he flatly denies any misconduct. UE fired McCarty less than a month after the university hired a law firm to investigate reports of alleged sexual misconduct and violations of the university's Title IX policy. UE officials say they also got reports of other alleged misconduct since McCarty was hired nearly two years ago. Now, Eyewitness News Mike Pickett has been following this story. He joins us now in the studio with reaction from McCarty's lawyer. What did he say, Mike? Well, uh, John Little, who represented McCarty since last month, uh, said his client was shocked and apologized for the impact the situation caused. Now, as for the uh, process, Little said the university's promise to have an independent, impartial investigation did not happen, adding McCarty didn't even have a hearing on the allegations against him. He also claims the university hired a law firm they worked with in the past to draft the university policies to help in the investigation. Little also alleges UE prevented his client from defending himself against the allegations as part of his contract. Bottom line is that the university uh, had their mind made up before this started and worked with their lawyers who wrote their policy to um, you know, do this quote investigation and, and, and there was no impartiality, there was no uh, neutrality. Yesterday, UE officials say McCarty was warned of inappropriate behavior and he also did training regarding acceptable behavior under, under Title IX. The case is still under investigation. We also reached out to several university officials for a further comment on the firing, but our requests were denied. The Board of Trustees Chair Linda White told me the board stands by the university's decision to fire McCarty. All right. Now, in light of all the things the attorney is saying, are they going to take any other steps? What are the next steps for McCarty and Little? Uh, Little told me he hasn't talked about their next steps yet. Uh, one reason for it is McCarty is mourning the loss of his stepfather who passed mm -hmm. away late last week. Okay, we're sorry to hear that about uh, Coach McCarty or former Coach McCarty, but of course we'll keep watching this to see what happens. Thank you very much, Mike, for that update.